What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Trevi Trev, and I'm about to hit the gym. You know, this is a little post work. I mean, pre-work, uh, look at me early in the morning. There's a little pre-workout video. Um, I just ate some breakfast. You know, I'm about to hit the gym. I'm about to get productive on this uh, Tuesday morning. But, you know, I just wanted to make this video because, you know, I was just in my car, you know, I was thinking and I was thinking about like my goals in life, what I want to do next after I leave the corporate field and just a lot of a lot of like deep things before I go to the gym. I was just thinking about these things. And then I thought of something. I thought of something because I had a conversation with my friend last week and we were just talking about life and we were talking about how it usually more often than not comes full circle because both of us, we're trying to be our best selves. And, you know, we usually have these conversations every now and then. I mean, we don't talk as much as we used to, but, you know, me and him, we always talk and we're always cool. We're always homeboys. That's my brother for life. And we were just talking about life. And I was thinking about that conversation like a week or so later. And then I was thinking about how life has come full circle for both of us, honestly, because we're both becoming like the people we're meant to be. And I think that's a good message for for you guys, because when you think about life, you start to you start to think like a lot of people get down and they get frustrated when they're not where they want to be in life. But, you know, once you go through the progress of I mean, the process and you keep progressing, you keep going through things, you start to end up where you are always destined to be. And you start to, how do you say, you start to um, see see things for what they are. And then you start to become more like people you don't expect. Because, heck, I think about it sometimes. And I think about how when I was younger, I say, I never do this. I never do this. But, you know, the saying never say never is always true. Because you never know what you're going to get into in life. You never know how, how things are going to turn out. You never know how you might turn out. Because, heck, like, I always said to myself, you know, I'm never going to do certain certain things my family is going to do or what they did in life. And then I ended up doing some of those things or I ended up not doing those things or I ended up doing these things with a different sort of twist. But all in all, life has come full circle. And, you know, it's starting I'm starting to see that I'm I'm more similar to not them to people because, you know, growing up, a lot of people, they always say I'm like, oh, you're just like so and so and you're just like so and so. And I used to never, never like that connotation because I'm my own individual. I make my own decisions. I make my own choices and I'm I'm different. I'm truly different. But as I get older, I understand, you know, I am sort of like these people they talk about, but I but I'm also right, too. I'm also correct, too. But, you know, life is kind of coming full circle and showing me, you know, it's not wrong to be like this person or this this person or or the person they compare you to but you also got to balance yourself and that comparison but you know life has come full circle and then what i'm trying to do next i'm becoming just like someone i admire and you know i uh, my friend he pointed that out to me and you know i, I never thought of it like that until I, I truly sat down and thought about it which i've been thinking about it for weeks i've been thinking about it today and it's just it's just on my mind heavy before i hit the gym and you know I'm not really like a, a super deep thinker in the morning. I like to sleep more than I like to think in the morning. But, you know, I just thought about it and how in all of our lives, we can, we can understand that development and how we can all sort of become our, our best selves in a sense by going back to the source and just seeing ourselves grow and just complete that circle of life because, you know, you never truly know. And, you know, life is it's different. It's truly different. And we all have our unique sort of experience. But, you know, once we once we start to realize, self-actualize and self-realize ourselves, we start to say, hey, man, I see how someone could have saw me being this way or I see how I could be this way. But, you know, I want to be my own person. And, you know, you start to complete yourself like you're sort of like a puzzle. You just keep filling in the pieces for yourself. And eventually you find that sort of niche that you want. And I feel like me leaving the business corporate field, I feel like I'm truly doing what I want to do. And I'm getting back to my sort of personality because I feel like being a professional, I feel like I, I sort of left elements of my personality behind, but you know, I'm getting, I'm getting that back now and I'm starting to become more like myself again. And, you know, I don't care about that corporate image. I can give a fuck at this point because I, it's like, I'd rather be, be, be satisfied with myself than be this corporate stooge, you know? And, you know, there's things from the business world that I'm always going to, to take in terms of how I speak and how I act in certain settings. But, you know, I'm done with that field and I'm happy to be done with that. And I'm glad to be back to who I am. And I'm finally coming full circle. And I'm finally going to 
get into a career path that I want to be in and I'm in a good headspace. And, you know, even though things are rough right now, I'm in a great headspace. And, you know, I just been getting up more motivated and I've been driven. And, you know, I just I just see the light at the end of the tunnel. You know, I've been digging, digging, digging for years in this business world. But now I see that it's all worthless. And, you know, even though I went to school for this, even though I used to have a passion for it, I don't have it anymore. But I have a passion for what I'm doing next. And, you know, I'm very excited about that. And I feel like in a sense, as I've how, how I've been developing as a person is coming full circle. And, you know, a lot of us, you know, we're going to have that moment at some point in life. And I feel like I'm making this video to say, you know, don't be afraid to understand that life is a cycle. And then eventually you'll come full cir circle and you'll you'll actualize who you're meant to be. But you just got to be patient along the road and you just got to keep going. But with that said, I'm about to hit this gym. You know, I'm about to do what I got to do. I just had to go on a little a little a little revelation on my video but you know and also my food is digesting you know you can't you can't go to the gym on an empty stomach and you know i had to let it settle i had to let the protein powder and the dunkin and all that settle and my body is feeling great and then you know i just had this morning message for you guys but anyway don't be afraid to complete yourself don't be afraid of, of coming full circle for yourself and just do what you got to do to to become who you who you who you're meant to be in a sense but anyway, that's the video for today. Like, comment, subscribe. You guys know what to do. You guys know your purpose for the week and just kind of stay driven and stay on your path.